How do? Welcome back. Well, a couple of days ago, I put a video up uh, where I had a br I did a brew day, and I was using the Muntons Peach IPA, which was kindly given by Brew at Home Shop, and I mentioned in that video that uh, I thought this this company, this business, was quite unique because not only are are they a home brew shop. They've got a physical shop and a, an online shop. But they're also brewers. They also have a brewery. And that brewery's name is Nailmaker. Nailmaker Brewing Company. And after I made the video and it was uploading, I went online and I, I thought to myself, I wonder if they've got a website. And they do. Really nice website. And they have a shop. So I thought got to try the beers <laughs> so I bought myself and I did buy this uh, it's about 30 pounds and uh, it's a 12 12 beer box set and you can choose which ones you want and so I chose 12 and uh, they arrived today so I thought I'd show you them all and what I'm actually going to do is uh, is do reviews of them but uh, before I get to that, not only did they sell the beer, they also sold glasses. So for an extra fiver, I thought I'll buy a glass as well. So this is their nail maker pint glass. There was a there was like a mug, a tanker, and a pint glass. So I got the pint glass, and I must say, that's a really nice glass. It's <laughs> it's it's not like the other ones that just break, Spiegelau that just break whenever you knock them. This is a this is a sturdy glass, so that's an extra fiver. So I bought that, and I thought that would be good for doing the reviews in. So let's let's see what I bought. First up is a Clout Stout. Good weather for stout. Uh, what does it say here? A rich and luscious stout, black chocolate and coffee flavors with a great mouth feel. What I like about these bottles as well is they actually tell you what hops have been used, what malt's being used. Uh, you don't find that a lot with brewers, uh, but I thought that was really nice. And it comes in at 5%, so that's nice. That's the first one. Second up is Auckland Pale Ale, obviously using New Zealand hops. And it says... A heady mix of premium New Zealand hops, a flavour profile including citrus, gooseberry and grapefruit. That's nice and that's coming in at 4% so nice sessionable beers. It's the Auckland, what's next? Whoa. Anvil Porter, that's 4.4% and it's a dark porter with a generous addition of chocolate malt. Mm. So I've got that. Next up, Chinook Pale Ale. So, uh, well, that's an American, isn't it? And it says here, single hopped beer using American Chinook hops, giving grapefruit, citrus and pine. Oh, that'd be nice. I chose also well you've they're in Barnsley in Yorkshire so you've got to you've got to try the Yorkshire bitter uh, this is 3.6% really nice and it's a traditional session bitter just as you would expect a Yorkshire bitter to be deliciously quaffable I like Yorkshire bitters next one Mango Magic, Man Mango Magic Mosaic. It says here, American Mosaic hops bring fruity aromas, including mango, passion fruit, and blueberry. A little extra magic mango further enhances a classic beer. So another American style beer there, or American inspired. Another bitter, fall bitter. And it says here, a rich, warm, 
tradition is that traditional i haven't got my proper glasses on a rich warm uh, something bitter anyway that's a that's a bitter i haven't got my proper glasses on really to read and it's uh, it's a bit hard but uh, that's coming in at 4.3 percent nice bitter there I've also got a chocolate safari rich dark stout coming in at 5.5 and this is easy to read it's white on black a rich luxurious stout brewed with organic cocoa nibs from Sao Tomo brewed in collaboration with Kurdish chocolate I think it's pronounced an award-winning chocolatier so that's going to be very chocolatey I would think We then have Mosaic Pale Ale. This beer was uh, this beer uses American Mosaic hops. Uh, it provides fruity. Just let me read fruity aromas, including mango, with hints of pine. This is four point one percent. So they're all really sessionable beers. Ooh, probably too sessionable. <laughs> I want this to last me all Christmas. Oh, what's this one? Oh, chocolate safari extra. Triple chocolate stout. It's the same as the other. Just got more chocolate in. Oh, and that's coming in at 5.5%. Uh, and then I got two cans. So you can choose if you want uh, bottles or cans. Uh, this is grapefruit pale citra. 4.1% so obviously it's a single hop citra beer with an extra zing of grapefruit using citra hops which have zesty aromas and flavours of lime, grapefruit, mango, lychee and gooseberry. Light and very refreshing. That's nice. And again on the cans they've actually got you know the malt that they use. This is Morris Otter and Wheat. They've got the hops, obviously. This is just Citra. So I like that they actually tell you the grain and the hops that they use. Not many do. And finally, Cardinal Sin. Now, I'm quite looking forward to trying this. Uh, a delicious mix of citrus, grapefruit and tropical pineapple flavours with a hint of bitterness. And if I just read you the uh, the hops, it's just a single hop and it's Styrian Cardinal. I've never ever tried that hop. In fact, I don't think I've heard of it. So I'm going to be quite interested to uh, to try this one. It's 4.4%. So that's the uh, that's my beer haul. It cost me £30 for the box, those 12 beers. Uh, the bottles are, let me have a look. 500 mil. I think the cans are 440. Or is it? Uh, yeah, 440 mils in the cans. Uh, so yeah, that was really nice. And of course, I've got my uh, nail maker glass as well, which was I think it was about five or six quid, something like that. But it's really, it's a really sturdy glass, is that? Unlike them Spiegelow. Anyway, <laughs> quick video. I might actually uh, do a review of one. <laughs> Uh, this afternoon uh, got my taste buds going so uh, there we go this is uh, nail makers uh, little uh, selection box that they have on their website and uh, yeah I just thought I'd show you and I'll be doing reviews of them all so that's coming up well thanks for watching it's been a pleasure and I'll see you again in the next video bye bye for now